Nokia 6300 disassembly and assembly hints. You will need the following tools, the SRT6, metal tweezers, the SS93, the SS45 camera removal tool, a straight bladed screwdriver, the dental pick, the bit holder with a Torx plus size 6 bit, a torque driver and a DC plug. Always cover the windows with a protective film. Shift out the seat cover. Remove both screws in the order shown. Remove the screws. Unlock the plastic clips of the A cover with the SRT6 on both sides. Lift up the cover now. Remove the K-May. Protect the window from inner side. Unscrew the four screws in the order shown. Remove the screws. Separate these screws. Do not mismatch them with the others. Cover the display with the film. Turn the assembly. Lift up the B cover. Remove the camera gasket. Unlock and remove the camera with the SS45. Release the flex shielding lid and discard it. Do not use it again. Unlock both metal clips of the UI shield. Carefully unlock the flex connector of the LCD module. Peel up the protective film. Now separate the parts as shown. Cover the display with a film again. Remove the microphone and the DC jack. Carefully lever out the earpiece assembly. Carefully unlock the clip securing the plastic chamber. Now remove it. The IHF speaker is not glued and can be removed easily. Carefully release the clips of the LED on the side window. The power and the volume key can be removed easily. Release the shown metal snaps of the label cover SE with the dental pick. Turn the assembly and open the sim lid. Now release these two latches.
Use the dental tool to push out the last clips. Release the label cover assembly, beginning from the bottom side. Mind these clips. The disassembly procedure is now completed. Additional assembly hints. Keep in mind that the label cover assembly with the type label must always be assembled together with the corresponding engine module. Insert the label cover assembly into the B cover as shown. Carefully push your latches into their places. Close the sim lid. Check the correct positioning of all these latches. Insert the lead on the side window. Note that they can't be interchanged. Note that the IHF speaker contacts belongs to their pads. Secure all clips of the plastic chamber before going on. Always use a new flex shielding lid. Mind the guiding tab while replacing the camera. Push it into its place. Set the correct torque. Turn the screws to the left first to engage the threads, then tighten them slightly. Apply the correct torque to all screws in the order shown. Tighten both screws of the C-cover in the order shown, too.